everyone, so I'm playing a question the game again today and I've just collected my rewards, my daily login rewards, and that was some of the e-coin or the gold horse head currency. And I'm still looking for a mare, so let's just check out the horse market really quick. Cause I wanna see if there's any nice mares for my stables, because um, when they bring in breeding, I wanna be able to breed. So let's have a little look. Oh, this one's really pretty. I do like the colour, but it's a thoroughbred and I'm going for Swedish Warmbloods, so I can't see anything on here at the moment, which is unfortunate, but that's okay. Right, and the other thing I wanted to do was, oh, they've got rid of all the Halloween stuff by the looks of it, so Halloween has gone. I did get some of the skelly horses on the market, I did find some, so I will insert some footage of what I found. I didn't buy any because the skin is just going to disappear, so I thought there was no point, but I did record finding them. Alright, so the thing I wanted to check was, okay, so my horses had this bug going on with the form and no matter what I did, they were just losing form. So what I'm going to try and do is do a little test and see if that has been fixed. I'm going to use um, Topaz and I'm going to give him some form food, top up feed. Let's give him one of those. It should increase form by 30% for 25 minutes. So let's feed him one of those. And then let's go and test it out because it wasn't working before. They were just, they were decreasing, but they were not like going up with anything that I did. So let's uh, go and do a little um, competition. Oh, they've changed things. Okay, this looks different here. The horse looks very alert. Topaz is ready to go. Okay, so let's do some show jumping. Now, um, he did make it to Grand Prix, so we're going to do a little Grand Prix. And, oh, they still haven't fixed the bug where it doesn't give you your... Um, medals correctly but that's okay and yeah all, as you can see like all my horses form is decreasing and it's just getting worse and worse oh wow he looks great standing there wow and my rider pats him now okay that's really cool and they also have the tack on now they used to not have their tack on so this is great so they've done a few little changes to how everything looks and i'm, I'm loving that so this bit is all the same, it tells you um, how to get the, the times to get the different medals. I'm a little bit rusty, so we'll see how this goes. Oh, we got a refusal. Okay. Oh gosh, I'm doing really bad. Oh, I'm very wobbly.
Go, go, go. Oh, this is totally my bad riding. You do have to keep practicing to keep kind of on form yourself, I guess. Okay, so that was absolutely terrible, but Okay, now this is new as well. They've added a trot animation with your rider on it at the end of a competition, which is great. I really like that. That looks really cool. And yeah, we'll just ignore my totally bad performance there. I am very rusty, <laughs> so what can you do? Okay, so I got some money. Now, the thing that we are going to be looking at is, did that improve his form at all? I really hope they fixed that bug because some of my horses' performance does rely on um, their form. So at the moment, no, it has not done anything, but sometimes it can take a couple. So we're going to do a couple more and see if it increases it. Okay, so I'm still terrible, but that was within the time, and I only got eight penalties, so a little bit of improvement going on there. And let's have a little look. Has that improved his form? Has it moved at all? No, it has not moved one single bit. So it looks like form is still bugged, which is kind of annoying. Okay, so I've just looked at the Discord and they're still working on the form and this was an update at the time of recording today at 6.32 a.m. So it's still a bug. It's still a bug and I'm, I shouldn't be worrying about it. Okay. Um, where are we? Where are we with Topaz? Let's have a look at his um, little stat thing here, I guess you would call it. Okay, so he's coming on quite well. He has made it to Grand Prix, but there is still a lot of training that he could be doing. So anyway, I could feed him and 
Then I can put him into training while I ride another horse that probably needs it a little bit more than him. So he has no energy, so I need to feed him a carrot. Can I feed you the carrot? It's lagging a little bit, I think. There we go, so he has a carrot. Mambo. Now Mambo I think is my most trained horse as it stands right now. Still need to work a little bit on his gates here and mentality, speed, responsi responsiveness and stamina. So those are the ones I need to work on with him. And Bellamy, we're not really doing anything with Bellamy right now because Dressage is not in the game. He needs a lot of training but he is my Frisian, my lovely little Frisian, my only Frisian that I have. And then there's the poor lonely little girl Fauna, my only female horse, my only mare, and her training is looking pretty good too. So we don't need to work on her today. So that was Fauna and then in the second stable block we have Milton and I know that Milton needs some training to progress onto the next level so Ooh, he's an option. We can maybe do some work with Milton today. And then Zombie, who we named from the Halloween update. We decided to give him a Halloween name. He's pretty good too. So it's looking like Milton. I don't think I have any other horses. No. So let's have a little training session with Milton. Because I think he needs it the most. First of all, I'm just going to check his tack. See what we've got on him with tack. Oh yeah, that was the Milton tack, wasn't it? Okay, so we'll keep that. Do I need to feed him? No, not really. We don't have the energy feed anymore. The energy feed is gone and also, I can't remember what it's called, but the stuff that makes it last longer, that's gone too. So let's go and do some training. Ooh, where should we go? Oh, I haven't been in the desert for a while. Let's go to the desert. Okie dokie, Milton. So let's have a look at what training we can be doing with him. I normally start off with speed as it's easy to do. There's nothing for turnability. We'll ride up to the jumps. And then, oh, they've changed the shape of this um, the energy thing. It used to be a circle, then it's kind of like a, a squarey circle now. And I guess um, we'll do a little bit of canter. Can we do another one? Possibly. Let's see about that then. Okay, let's go Milton. So I'm going to do like the full speed beginner. I forgot how big Milton was. Did we make him like 17 hands or something? Okay, and then I need to slow him down into working and then go right back up. And then up here there's normally something spooky but he hasn't spooked. Okay, now I just slow him right down. Let's do a little turn around because we want to be at this little jumping arena up here. So I'm just going to go up and down again. Okay, that's cool. I think that's all done. Let's double check. Speed is all done. So I'm going to do jumping next. So turn around Milton and let's go. Might as well do his canter ones while we're on the way to the jumping place, which is just through here. And we have spookies, so we give him lots of love, lots of pets. Don't go running away with me, Milton. Lots of love. And we get the bubbles. 
and there is the jumping arena through here so we're just going to go on through and do a little bit of jumping Did they add a skid sound effect? It sounded like they, they never used to have that before, I'm pretty sure. Oh, and did you know guys, they've actually released it in Ireland now as well, which is really cool. So Ireland now has this game as well. Oh, I'm, I'm totally fluffing this. Okay, yeah, so Ireland has the game as well now, so that's really cool. I really hope that it comes out in other countries as well soon, but it looks like it's getting faster and faster, the release between the countries, so I'm really excited. It's going to whiz around all these. I think we need to do quite a few because I'm not sure if I... Oh, oh no. Oof. I'll tell you guys, I've, I've really become very rusty at this game. Very rusty at my jumping skills. Plus, I don't know, like the game feels like it is lagging kind of a little bit, I don't know why, but, and he is running away with me a little bit here. Let's take this round a little bit wider. Nice jump, Milton, he's doing so well. That one was a little bit tight, but we did it, and he's speeding away with me again. He's a uh, hot... Oh! Okay. <laughs> Controls are hard, guys, really. For me, anyway. One more jump to go. Let's do it. Nice. So jump is done. Might as well do this canter. Gotta... Oh, okay. So what was... There we go. We've got to keep in an extended canter. But yeah, so they have kind of changed how the horse is... Um, personality kind of speeds them up and slows them down you used to be able to hold a button and it would pretty much maintain it that's gone you have to now always monitor the um the horse's speed and after a jump if it's warm-blooded hot-blooded it will speed up automatically and if it's cool-tempered or cold-blooded it will slow down and you can't just press and hold one button to um to maintain one speed anymore which i like because it does make it more interesting and it also makes it a little bit harder so what are we up to let's have a look at the training so we've done speed we've done jump canter we need to do some collected canter okay now in here it's pretty tight but I will try my best let's maybe even move the camera so we can see Milton a little bit more and we're gonna do a collected canter and hopefully not smash into things too much because it's very tight in here so we're gonna try and do that now try and get him on the right lead. He's doing well so far. His ears are still forward right now. So then we need to stay within 50 to 100 percent in gate counter collected. Okay, so that's the last one, and I think I'm out of energy though, but it might let me do it.
Okay, so it told me I'm low on energy, so... So I can't do that. I would have to feed him another carrot now. That's good that it tells you now that um, you've run out of energy. So well done, Milton. You did so well, little lad. We'll have to go and give him another carrot and then bring him back. It's a shame you can't just feed him a carrot in here to continue it on. You have to come out. But yeah, he did really well. And hopefully, let's see how much we gained from that. Oh, I could do a little bit of mentality because that doesn't use... Um, any energy so let's just walk back through that spooky place uh, if I can get the camera behind him oh that's a pole okay no turn around okay let's go through the spooky spooky place around here and work on that mentality just a little bit before we go because as we're here we might as well try and keep him at a bit of a trot Although he will speed up on his own, which he just did. Spooky place is kind of, I think it's around here. Come, yeah, here we are. So we'll just walk him past. Get a little bit of mentality. There we go. And you could just keep repeating that, but I'm gonna take him back. And we will leave the trail ride. Okay, what did we get? We got speed, canter, strength, which is what I needed for the next level. Jump, we have increased jump. That was what that little noise was. We increased jump twice. Oh, um, you've increased uh, mentality as well, so that's really good. Okay, we can leave now. Okay, so he's looking a little bit better. I wonder if he can move up to the next level in his competition. So we'll just go check that. Oh, there he is. He's looking very alert and proud. So where is he at? He's still in novice. So we would need to compete with him in Novice to see if he can be moving on to the next level. So we'll just do that real quick. Oh, he has... Oh, let's feed him. There we go, Milton. I just love the pose. I love this new pose. I think it looks great. Big fan. And the little ears keep moving. Oh, and he does a little head toss. It'd be funny if, like, the tail could swish about a bit and, you know... I like it though, the rider is looking around a bit, not just kind of standing there static, so I love that. Okay, Ranger Route 70 to 90, let's go. We. Oh, we hit one at the end. Oh no, Milton. Oh, it didn't knock down though. It was just a clip. Okay, cool. And he's trotting along there. So, oh, I love it. I love it. So it looks like he's still in novice. There is Milton. Uh, he's about half energy. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna feed him. It's a little bit of a waste of a carrot, but I don't want to have to like come out and feed him again and then 
go back in, so... Milton, are you sure you... Yeah, we'll just do it. Oh, okay, yeah. Okay, so he's full on energy now. Lovely, and let's go to... No, that's not it. Let's go for a ride. Uh, we did the desert. Let's go in the riding? No, let's go countryside meadows. Okay, so, um, we are gonna do... No, we don't need to do that. Let's do jump. And then we will do canter. And maybe we can get a trot. So we're just going to chill around here with Milton and let him get some training in. This place is really pretty and I like how the um, the sky looks when it's this time of day. It's really like peach colours and I do love me peach colours. Very relaxing. Am I meant to be an extended canter right now? Yeah. Okay. Trying to do like two birds with one stone basically, do the canter. Oh, he's scared, he's scared. Pat, pat, pat. Get some bubbles. Okay, and I'm going to finish the rest of the jumping before I do the collected canter. Because it's just basically like a little route that I do around here. Which has courses, um, which has jumps leading up to the kind of arena. And there is a really good spot for doing mentality. I'll probably I can show you that. That's where I do most of my mentality training. And it's just around the corner of this little lake here, actually. So it's some um, extra spooky bushes around the corner. So I will show you my spot. And it's it's right here, actually. So I normally just canter through here or trot, whichever, and it seems to get their mentality up really quickly just going through these two like sets of bushes here and then I just turn around and go back through pat 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 yeah and I, I when I want to do like a lot of mentality training I'll basically just rotate go through those two sets of bushes there and I don't I don't stop because it doesn't seem to work as well when I stop opposed to trotting through them by trotting through them it seems to do it better than if I actually stop and let him face it but let's test it and stand here and see if it does it quicker or does it more you see I'm not getting any bubbles but then if I like start moving again then I get the bubbles so yeah keeping on the move seems to do it slightly better from my experience anyway see I'm getting quite a lot of bubbles lots of bubbles right back to the jumping whoa there's a rock okay nice turn ability oh might as well just get a little bit more in pet 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 Alright, and the jumping arena is literally on our left here, so let's go in here. And we'll just work him around here, and then after that we will do the, um, the collected canter to finish the canter. Thank you. 
He definitely seems like he's jumping a little bit higher than when I first got him. It's like he's uh, picking his feet up a little bit more. Oh, I, I was like, can I risk it? Can I take this one at a very tight angle? But no. Oh, and that's a pole. I'm sorry, Milton. Oops. We did it! Nice! Okay, let's go out of here and work on that collector canter. And I'll switch the camera around so we can see him, because it looks really cool. Oh, and he's scared again, so we'll give him some love. Okie dokie, and then I just need to check uh, counter. So it's just that last one. Love, love, love. He oh, was he gonna buck me then? Maybe. Okay, so let's get back into collect. Well done, Milton. Okay. Oh, we have a little bit of energy left to do a trot, so we'll just do this. Why not? Oh, okay. Slow down. There we go. Stay there. You have to constantly adjust the reins to keep them... Whoa, see, he's speeding up again. Stay there. Stay there. Two seconds. One second. Yay, okay. Pretty sure that's all the energy gone. Pretty sure I can't do anything else now. Yeah, it's telling me. So, we'll go back to the stable. Oh, a little bit of mentality. Why not? Yes, let's take a little bit of mentality training while we're here. Beautiful. Well done, Milton. He's such a good boy. I can't wait till he uh, progresses further in his career, but he is going to take a lot more training, guys. So, let's see... Slow down. Let's um, go back and see what we got from that. So jump has increased. Canter. So it was strength and jump we needed to work on, wasn't it? So that's good. Strength has been improved. And jump has, has leveled up. Brilliant. Okay. So I just need to keep doing this, basically. Lots of carrots though, it's going to cost. Okay Milton, where are you at now? Let's have a little look. So he's coming along alright. I think um, what I'm going to do is uh, maybe do another episode working with Milton, trying to get him progressed up so he can do next level of uh, competitions. Uh, because yeah, he's the horse that has had the least love out of all my horses and it's making me sad and I want to work on him a bit more. So yeah, I think that's it for today. Um, hopefully they fix that form bug soon and we will carry on with Milton and get him to the next stage as quickly as we can because he's stuck in novice right now and I want him to do better than that. So that's it for today guys. Thanks for watching. Take care and goodbye. Mm -hmm.